Well, while you're looking at that, um, for funsies, uh, back to the Chinese astronauts for a minute, don't feel bad for them at all because they just pulled off a space first and have done barbecue for the first time in space. Wait, how does that work? How does that work? Would you like to see? Because they have a really awesome oven that they have uh, done this with, which looks um, pretty simple, honestly. Uh, They just have this small grill. (laughs) They're literally putting it on this grill, and I believe that that black uh, um, panel that they're putting it on has some sort of um, special type of material to catch some of the grease. You'll see in a minute here once uh, they pull this out when it's cooked. But they've cooked chicken, and a little bit later in this vehicle, they uh, video, not vehicle, they also cooked some beef as well, doing barbecue in space for the first time. And when you see their faces and their reactions, they just look so happy, so yeah. happy. And this is one of those things that you just have to fix in space because like food is such an integral part of being human. And mm-hmm. I don't want to eat bugs the whole way to Mars. Like I don't want to have to eat just things in packets all the way to Mars. Mm-hmm. This looks awesome. Look at this. And look at that. The grease all like kind of oh. congealed onto it. So I think they cut away and, and kind of wiped it off a little bit or just ate it like it is. But you could see uh, that a lot no, of the grease it, is congealed it like on it there. Is. <laughs> can you just imagine though like all the different smells like i always hear about how the smells at the iss get horrible after a while and oh man what a change of pace that would have been although tian gong still new and fresh and everything like that but this is so cool well now I'm it's gonna very have, envious now it's gonna have it's duck all, fat on the walls it's all fun and games until somebody cooks fish in the microwave Oh Sebson Y3F says the oven is also intended for research purposes. The issue of fats in the air was discussed. I'm like I could totally see that, like getting a like fine coat of like mm-hmm. God. They do seem super happy. Like yeah. imagine having like, like pre-packaged research, food for yeah. Research this pizza into my mouth. That's what's up with that. <laughs> Best oh meal man, that's we've what we need next. While. We need the first pizza in space. Oh, there's the Wagyu. Yeah, there's the way you beef right there. And uh, it, this one was a bit interesting because you see how large they are right there. When they pull these out, they shrunk quite a bit. Oh, actually, it's a completely different video. Let me let me find that one for you guys where it, they keep going. While uh, you're doing on. that, uh, Stoge also said, because uh, this is in her wheelhouse, uh, actually, nutritionally, this is a great step forward. Astronauts struggle to get enough calories and lose weight during their flight. The fats would help here a lot. And that actually makes that makes a ton of sense. Although I... <laughs> pretty sure so there's going to be just this thin over time just this thin coat of fat like on the station walls <laughs> right it's just going to like get into the air and just go boop onto the walls that's okay because there's no in, there's microgravity in, right in in an emergency you can just lick the walls for your protein <laughs> No. Yeah, we fried Gross. our electronics. Sorry, guys. We need we need some uh, re- replacements uh, for for what uh, uh, we got here. Yeah, here's that's a... not dielectric grease. <laughs> <laughs> Man, they and you know I think this is an important thing to point out too, which is that food is psychologically advantageous as well. It's it's not just nutrition; it keeps you happy. Good food makes you a happy person and if there's one thing that you need to be in a very small contained space with a lot of people it's happy if you can make that whole contained space the kitchen right like that's the heart of the home it is the heart of your space station your spaceship too right so like i mean legitimately they're all smiling look at this this is amazing yeah never never thought i'd be like oh my gosh barbecue in space is the thing that brings joy to everyone but like look at that 